Good afternoon. Today is a very special day. Today is day one, the 17th of June, 2021. And I did a video the other day of my Tesla and somebody commented that the uh, video was rather boring. And I probably agree with that person because it was a Tesla. Today's a very special day. It's day one of the Petrol Head Tours 2021. And here I am at the garage to collect my car, but there's a bit of a problem. Baby M135. Um, unfortunately, after the last tour, it spent a lot of time getting new work done, um, but it started also throwing error codes. So at the moment, it's in a bit of a state of disrepair. Somewhere in there, there is um, a lovely water injection kit, a couple of new radiators, um, some a new hybrid turbo, and lots of goodies, uh, a new wheels, new tires, everything ready to go for this tour. But anyway, the reason why today's such a special day is because uh, with my normal car broken, a good friend of mine has lent me uh, his car for the 11 days. And this is gonna be the polar opposite of the Tesla. So there should be a hell of a lot more smiles in this video for everybody out there that is wondering. Um, what the polar opposite would be. Well, here we have it, the uh, Caterham 420R. Uh, just So I've just loaded up the vehicle. Actually took quite a lot of stuff, but the main <coughs> the main, um, main thought I had was, I've loved Caterhams for, well, since I was very young, and I've never been able to find really good YouTube content, specifically uh, spirited driving on the road. There's been a few, uh, we've all seen the videos with the Caterhams where they try and go to Tesco, all that sort of nonsense. Um, and I think I'm gonna be able to make a really great um, video for you guys that captures the sort of footage that I would enjoy watching with some great scenery, gonna be away with some great other cars, great drivers, and um, well, I hope to fill that niche in the market. So, ready to set off. It's looking, there's warnings of thunder. So I'm gonna try and get down the A3 uh, to Portsmouth without um, having to put the roof up. And I will try and park up there and then uh, go over the car, explain a little bit more about it uh, before we get the boat, which leaves for Santander tonight at 10 p.m. Thanks for watching, catch you soon. Okay, YouTube, so here we are in Portsmouth. I made it just before the rain, so really happy about this. Got up to the top floor, this multi-story car park next to the port, and it's just started to pour out there. So main thing is managed to get here on the motorway without putting that damn roof on. I have no idea how I'm gonna climb into it if I have to do that. Um, but hopefully once in Spain, it's gonna stay dry. This here uh, gives you an idea of the um, I'm packing, closed for 11 days, laptops, headphones, rubbish like that, um, sp uh, spares kit, fleece, and a, well, most importantly, box of wine. Ferry journey is two, two days, so I need, to, need something to keep me uh, going for those days in the, in, in the cabin on my own. Um, roof kit, there's the roof, it's a full roof. I couldn't get any half hood, which is a, a better option because it lets wind escape from the car. So I've only got the half hood. Uh, the model is the 420R. We've got these ZZS tires here, brand new all round. Um, those should last me the tour. In fact, they better last me the tour because there's no way I'm gonna get those. Even in the UK, it was a real uh, issue. I was so lucky to find some. Um, but yeah, I'd, I'd have, in something this light, there's no way I'm gonna go through those. They've got, um, of course, nowadays we've got the new GB number plates. So I'll pop one of those on. Apart from that, gonna try and keep it a bit cleaner than it's looking. And we, when we're on tour, we, we have the sat-navs. So I found a nice place for the sat-nav and I've got this little visor to stop the sun from shining. There's our controls. Uh, steering wheel, of course, comes off like that. So yeah, main idea is with the video, uh, we've got 11 days of the Petrohead tours, realistically only eight days. 
of driving. I'm going to try and keep the talking to a, uh, to a minimum, maybe a little introduction at the start of each day. But what I feel is missing in YouTube are videos of these cars being driven properly on the open road. And what better place to do that than, the, than on the Petrol Heads Tour where we're going to have some amazing supercars, a real mix of cars actually, great driving talent, great venues, great scenery.
Rewind. 